Republican Party of Orange County is reeling from an attack on its headquarters in Hillsboro overnight. Police say a flammable material was thrown through a front window of the building, causing major smoke and fire damage. Carly Griffith is live from the headquarters now with me. Carly. <laughs> Yeah, first let me show you what else happened last night. Over here on the side of this building, you can say it, see it's since been covered up, but uh, graffiti was spray painted that said Nazi Republicans leave town or else. And then back here at the Republican headquarters, you can see this window behind me here. It's broken. That's where what Republican officials are calling a firebomb was thrown into the building. And here is some video taking us inside, looking at the damage. The state and county leaders of the Republican Party are not sure exactly what time this happened, but they know it happened after 7 p.m. That's when everyone left for the evening. Now, folks coming to one of the neighboring buildings here found it this way this morning. I'm told the fire burned itself out and damage was contained to the Republican headquarters, which some volunteers tell me is a blessing of sorts. Now, the feeling left by this vandalism is shock for the most part, but also anger at what the Republican Party is calling an assault on basic American beliefs. For something like this to happen, it's an assault. It's basically an assault. It is a terrorist act of assault on my rights, your rights, and anybody else's rights, whether they're Democrat or Republican or anybody in this county here. Now, the Democratic Party of North Carolina has also already responded to this incident, saying that this kind of violence is unacceptable in our political system. Hillary Clinton also tweeted saying that this, again, is unacceptable. Police, Hillsborough police, are investigating the incident. For now, live in Hillsborough, Carly Griffith, CBS, North Carolina.